Hey, it's Sheila Brothers. Now, nobody is more busy lately than Tom Meissen, Ichabod Crane on Sleepy Hollow. But he is literally joining us from a dressing room in which he's waiting for another interview. So, got to say thank you. Good morning, Tom. Morning, Sheila. You're a busy beaver this morning. I'm indeed. I'm indeed. I'm not allowed any rest ever. I haven't slept since I left Wilmington. That sounds about right. You haven't slept since episode one. No, quite. I haven't slept since uh, July. No, that's right. <laughs> I know you only have about five minutes, so I'm going to get right to it. All the questions that I have are from the fans, of course. Oh, lovely. So I've got to ask, of course, from the Tom Meissen fans on Twitter. They want to know about stunts and which ones you did yourself and which ones you're most proud of. Um, Pretty much all of them I did myself. Uh, The ones that I didn't do usually are the ones that include cold water. And then a brilliant stunt double called John Gilbert, who's a Wilmington local, uh, is the one who gets thrown into swamps and things instead of me. Oh, Lord. Poor John. I think probably the, the sword fight with Abraham in episode something or other is the one that I'm proudest of, I think. That's great, because that's what she said. She was hoping that your proudest moment was that sword fight. <laughs> oh, I'm always happy. Give me a sword, and then I'll, I'll be happy. <laughs> Pamela wants to know, how did you get that scar on your forehead? Well, Pamela, uh, it's, a, it's a deep secret that stretches back to the uh, beginning of my life. And if I was to tell you on radio, there's an awful lot of people I'd have to kill. <laughs> All right, we'll leave that one alone. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Nick Gonzalez, your cohort, wants to know more about Luke Morales' character. <laughs> uh, well... I am going to fight as hard as I can to make sure he's not in season two now. Uh, I was quite looking forward to exploring his story, but Nick Gonzalez has foiled it by that question. Uh, He will suffer. Actually, no, he will be in season two, but he'll be going through a lot of pain. Oh, that's great. I love it. Okay, Lodi would like to know, since you've been in America, especially North Carolina, have you experienced any culture shock? Oh, the, the use of the word or the term y'all. Y'all. <laughs> hey, y'all. That's, that was very new to me. Uh, yes, that's, uh, that's quite a, a common term, which uh, which doesn't really work in an English accent. <laughs> it doesn't really work when I say you, you all. Well, you can work on fixing, too. That's our other famous word here. I'm fixing to do something. Fixing to do something. I'll use that. <laughs> Mary Jo wants to know your real thoughts on skinny jeans. Dreadful. Dreadful. Um, on, on girls, they're fine, but um, I'm fixing to get them bound for men, y'all. <laughs> oh, my God, that's fabulous. Okay, Sleepy Hollow Source wants to know what aspect of Ichabod is most like you? It is most like me. You and Ichabod, what do you have in common? Oh, um, well, it depends what time of the day you catch me. If you catch me in the morning, I'll be moody. <laughs> Or if you catch you on oh. set with no sleep oh, for six I'm, months. I'm really sorry. There's a, there's a knock on the door. So. <laughs> no worries. You get going, Tom Meissen, everybody. Tom, thank you so much. It's a real pleasure. Ichabod Crane of Sleepy Hollow. The big two-hour episode 12-13 combo is January 20th, Monday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Fox. Thanks, Tom. Okay, thanks, Sheila. Bye.